So this is a quick video update about the Vilno kneeling chair. A couple of months ago, I was asked to test the chair, see what it's like. And I said to you in the video, which if you haven't seen is here, about improving my posture because I've got two slip discs, engaging your core and also keeping focus. So what's happened to the chair? Well, that chair has gone because my wife's taken it. Sorry to mess you around there, but that chair, the blue one, has actually gone to my wife. She's seen the way my posture's changed and actually looked at it and gone, maybe that'll help me too. So she now uses that chair in her work as opposed to her normal chair. So what am I sitting on right now? We were that impressed with the noble chair by Vilno, we got a second one. So I've actually got the grey one and my wife's got the blue one. Now I've found to use it in a couple of different ways, certainly as a musician and also whilst sitting at a desk. Getting on and getting off the Vilno chair isn't as easy as just sitting in a normal chair. However, the benefits of using the chair outweigh slumping in a chair and editing and just slumping down while you're on a meeting and you've got actually posture and you can be up and your chest's open and you can feel your core being engaged. But the other thing as well is I actually use the chair a little bit like a rocking chair when I'm playing music. I find myself rocking forwards and backwards but still keeping the right posture whilst playing as if I'm standing. The other way of using the chair is backwards, so actually sitting on the chair the other way around. This is really handy if you've got pedals on the floor or if you just want to grab something real quick and it's just like sitting on a normal stool. It's much easier to get on and off in that direction and it still rocks which helps with your core. Now the only thing I'd say with these kneeling chairs is that they're self-assembly and it comes with all the right tools including the little allen key for all the nuts. But one thing we didn't realize was when we moved my original chair, the blue one, over to my wife's office, it felt a bit rocky. And that's because you're moving around the chair, you're moving it forwards and backwards, the pads obviously are independent. So we used the Allen key and realized that we were tightening it up quite a bit. I'd actually been moving around quite a bit. And it was a good job we realized this because the screws naturally loosen because you're moving it slightly and it's a flexible thing. So my tip with this, certainly with the knee pads, is if they're moving quite a lot, it's probably that you need a little bit of tightening. But for me personally, the way I hold myself has improved certainly my breathing as well which I did mention in the previous video but I hadn't really got the benefit of that because it was only a couple of weeks in and it's been three months using this chair and I haven't regretted it. I'd like to thank Bill No for introducing me to this chair because actually it's introduced the chair to my family. My wife loves it, I love this chair and I don't think I'll be going back to a traditional style chair anytime soon. If you're someone who is writing or sitting at a desk or taking meetings in your office I would highly recommend a kneeling chair to improve your posture and help support you, your core and your back. I'll leave the video review video right here so you can watch it. See you in the next one.